Hello, my name is Wayne Godso from the Avaya Serviceability Engineering Team. This tech tip will cover configuring syslog on the ERS 8800 system. In our tech tip, we will configure the syslog server host entry. The ERS 8800 supports up to 10 remote syslog servers. We'll configure the remote syslog server IP address. We'll enable the syslog service for our new host entry. And finally, we'll view the status of our syslog service to verify our configuration changes. In our example, our first step is to create the host entry. In this case, it's the first syslog server entry in the system, identified by the command host, followed by the number 1. Next, we will configure the IP address of our remote syslog server for our host entry, which is host entry number 1. Next, we'll enable the syslog service for our host entry. This will force the syslog service to start logging to the newly configured syslog server. Finally, we'll view the status of our new syslog service with the show sys syslog command. Using this command, we can verify the syslog configuration is correct and has been enabled. We can also verify the severity warnings that are set for the system. This completes the configuration of our syslog service. Thank you for your time today. We hope this information was useful. We welcome comments, questions, and feedback at mentoravaya.com or on Twitter at Avaya Mentor. Thank you for choosing Avaya.